It's your boy Von. And your girl Tasha, and we are back, back with, with another, another video. video. You guys, today we got our first is mukbang. Mukbang. And I always mukbang. pronounce it mukbang, but it's mukbang. We got our first one today, guys. And guess what we have? We have the seafood fryer with the beloved sauce, guys. I did it. The Beloved Sauce. Y'all know how much I absolutely love Beloved. And I did her sauce today, guys. So I'm excited to try it. I'm anxious. He haven't tried it yet. I haven't really tried it yet. I just did exactly what she said. And so, what do we have? We have corn, uh, potatoes, shrimp, turkey sausage, and lobster tails. Did I say everything? Mmm. Yeah, that's um, and her sauce. And her sauce. And the beloved sauce. Can't leave so, that sauce. First mukbang. I guess let's talk and let's dive in. I'm ready. Let's get I'm it. I'm ready. You gonna go straight for the lobster tail, uh huh? I'm gonna go for the shrimp. I'm getting that lobster, what you talking about? Mmm. Uh -oh. oh my god. I'm over here struggling. Woo, y'all her sauce. Look at that sauce. Get some of that. Mmm. Woo. Oh so guys, and I have I have an extra bowl here for her sauce. Because I know he's not gonna share. Mmm. That's some good stuff right there now. So it's good, ain't it? Mm-hmm. Man. And it's not as spicy, but it's still got a kick to it, so. I like it. But anyway, so we're gonna do, we're gonna start doing Monday mukbang days. More well, mukbang. 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 Um, so Mondays we're gonna do mukbangs. So you guys can either suggest things you guys want us to do. Let me get some of that shrimp. Mm. Woo! <coughs> you got a kick to it, don't it? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm That's some good stuff though. That's some good stuff. So you guys can suggest like what you guys want us to do for our mukbangs or mukbangs oh my god I'm gonna just call them mukbang guys you know what I'm saying um so if you want us to try different restaurants for our Mondays you know sit in the comments and we'll do it or if you guys have like a seafood broil that you've done and want us to try your sauce or your seasoning that you made in there send it in the email or me on the comments or the email and we'll do it but first, I had to try my girl. Because everybody was talking about this sauce. That beloved sauce is on point. Woo! I don't know what I'm talking about right there now. Mmm. Oh, there we go. There we go, <coughs> baby. There we go. Definitely got a little kick to it. Just a little spicy. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. We love it. You stuck your foot in that sauce, girl. But not too bad. Mm-hmm. And what she said, she said, you don't have to make it as spicy. So I didn't try to make it as spicy. Um, because we don't really like spicy food. Spicy food. I do. We don't really like spicy food. Yes, like I, do. I don't know. And I just if it got a little kick to it, yeah, it's good. But like if it's just too hot, nah. Woo! I can't my stomach can't take that stuff no more. Not that spicy. This is this turkey sausage, y'all. This turkey sausage. I'm trying to get to that meat. Oh yeah, boy. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that right there now. Ooh, buddy. Mm. That's perfect. You splashing me? Hey. Hey. So. Look at that right there. Ooh. Mm-hmm. Look at that, y'all. Ooh, dip it in that sauce. Mm. And it was my first time actually cooking lobster tail, so I was excited about that. I was very excited. So, how is it? Let me taste, let me taste. Let me taste. Mm. I didn't nap on me. That's some good Ooh. stuff. Mmm. 
Mm -hmm. That stuff is good. Spicy. All right, guys. So I want to remind you guys, this stuff is so good. Wanna, I'm about to try that corn. I want to remind you guys about our Tuesdays. We go live on Tuesdays. Um, talk about relationships. And um, how to keep a healthy marriage. Yeah. They look good. And the bad. Being young and married. Mm -hmm. And um, I've been enjoying it. I've been enjoying it. It's been a, a, like a few weeks to a month that we did it. And last last Tuesday we enjoyed it. So I'm excited about this Tuesday. So make sure you guys are tuning in. Make sure your notification bells are on. And join the family. Join TV Square. Make sure you subscribe. We just jumped right in and we didn't even thank them. <laughs> thank you guys for subscribing to our channel. Sharing the video. Just showing us love, you know? And we thank you for commenting. We love having conversations with yeah, you guys. I like seeing who's watching. And a lot of you guys has been like loyal subscribers. You've been coming back. And just showing us love. You guys, this uh, beloved sauce is just... I'm a beloved fan, and this sauce is just everything. Whew. So good's making me sweat over here. <laughs> Some good stuff. This is really good. So you guys, make sure you suggest them what we should do next. Like what thing we should do next. Let us know, y'all. Cause this right here, this is right here now. Whew. It's good. I can eat this all day. It is way too good. Let me try this corn. Let me get in this corn. Let me get in this corn, y'all. Let me, let me get this Ooh, corn. Now I see why she be smacking like that. That's some good stuff. <laughs> That's some good stuff. I'm licking my hands, y'all. It's good. I haven't had corn since before my braces. I didn't you know, want to drink, drink. I didn't want to um, eat corn because it gets stuck in my braces. So I'm pretty excited to be eating this corn. I'm getting full. That lobster hit the spot. Did it? Mm-hmm. We're not. What are we drinking? The Minute Maid. Show them the drink. I'm drinking that Minute Maid Premium Berry Punch, natural berry flavor. That's what we're drinking. That's some good stuff. I love that stuff. That one and the strawberry. So you guys asked us, what do we do to keep our marriage um, good, healthy, and fun? First of all, I can answer that one. Keep God first. Yes. Oh that's my God. That's what we do all the time. Especially because, especially when it's bad, because some people don't know what? how they handle certain situations in their marriage. So the first thing we do, you know, we pray about it, come together. We say this in every video, communicate, which is the number one key to a marriage. And you know, just go from there. If you don't communicate, you're gonna have more issues. Right. It's not gonna solve anything. Like if you just nagging at each other all day, 24 seven, it's not doing nothing but separating y'all more. So. Right. So it, wanna, it doesn't make the marriage fun either. Yeah. It just causes tension within your marriage and it's like unnecessary tension. Because we like to keep that same fire that we had when we first met. Yeah. You know how you have all the butterflies and oh my gosh, he's so cute, she's so fine. That's how she was. He's so cute. <laughs> but we want to keep that, that going. We don't want to just have that Ain't while we that. dating. Oh, by we, when we first get married, you know, you still have a little butterfly and stuff when you first get married. We want to have that forever. Right. That's how I look at it. And you just got to keep it spicy. Keep it, you know, keep the marriage going. Keep dating. And like I said, we don't always get, I'm not even open. Can you open this for me, babe? I need to. Um, you got to take your anger out on that thing. <laughs> I need you another gotta, napkin. You got to twist them and. You getting it real good. Mm-hmm. I'm taking a lot of time. You know, we can't always uh, 
go on dates, but that doesn't mean stop dating. You can create a date night at home. We do it all the time. All the time. I splash on my face. Thank you, babe. Got my. No, that sometimes date night at home is fun to me. Mm -hmm. Got the movies, get you some popcorn, ice cream. You know, do all um, that stuff. And then we did. Um, what did we do last time? Canvas and painting. The canvas painting. Mm hmm. We did that. That was fun. Had our little competition. Um, and that was, I think that was fun itself. Yeah, because everybody thinks you can only have fun by going out spending money. That's not yeah. true. Like, yeah. you you can make fun. It don't matter what it is. And I'm, I'm a homebody. I don't like really, like, doing too much. I'm fine with being home. Me too. Especially when I work a lot. Yeah. I'm like, ah, let's just chill at home. Let's come up with something at home. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, buy, buy some board games. Do something. Buy board game, you know. Rent a movie, you know, Netflix. So right. Do something. Yeah, I always got to go out. Especially me, I'm cheap, so especially when it comes to going out, everything's so expensive now. Right. So. This is so good. I'm just dipping it, and I have a bowl here, guys. I'm dip. Look at that. Let me show you this. Let me take this. Bowl. Look at this, y'all. Mm. This is too much. This is too much. That's some good old sauce, boy. This is just way too much. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. But if you got kids, you know, put them on a schedule. Mm -hmm. Put them on a schedule. And I'm telling you, that will make your life and your marriage better. Because you're spending time with each other. Mm -hmm. Put them on a the schedule. You can't have them up to 12 o'clock at night. You know. All types of night. Even if you're up that late, you know, make them go to sleep so that way you and your husband can have time together. Yeah, so instead of nap time because you don't want them to go to sleep too early. Yes. Because like my son, he likes to try to go to sleep at like five o'clock <laughs> and then want to get up in the middle of the night. Nah, nah. When you take your naps, it's going to be around 10, 11, 12. It's yep. only going to be for like 20, 30 minutes. You yeah. ain't sleeping no hours because I already know you're going to be up all day and no, uh, we're not doing that. No. Yeah, so setting that time um, and make sure they're not later in the day so that way like he said, they can go to sleep right on time. Mm -mm -mm. This is too good, y'all. Mm. So we did painting. What else we do? Board games. Yeah. I love, we love cooking together. Like, sometimes we'll have a, a couple's cook night. And so what we'll do is, you know, sometimes make a little competition. I'm full now. I bet you are. I'm getting full too. Mm. This is a lot. Oh. oh okay. Alrighty. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did you eat some of the sausage? You, I don't think you had some of Oh, no. I was too busy smashing that corn and potatoes. Oh, that stuff is making me full. Try sausage real quick. But like having date night. Um, Get all that sauce in there. No cooking, cooking. I love cooking, and uh, you know I say I'm a little master chef. But we have a little competition, and it's fun because it's like we're cooking for each other. And some days he'll just, I'll come home and he'll have something already together, and then some days I'll just have stuff together for him. So that's how we do it. And then some days we just come together and want to cook together. It's like, you got to do stuff together that keeps that chemistry going. Keeping the romance. Some people say, I don't be wanting to be around them all day 24-7. We ain't around each other all day 24-7. No. I'm either, you know. And in fact, like, during the week, he has like a day that he go and play ball. You know, in the mornings on Saturdays. That's his, like, rest day. And then sometimes it's me during the week. It's just getting out. We're not together every day. Excuse me. We're not together every day. Because we know that can cause... It's like being around your brother and sister all day. Yeah. Every day. You need a break sometimes. Yeah, so... And that's okay. It's okay to get a break. It's okay. But, you know, just don't make sure that... Make sure that break is not too long. Mm-hmm. You know, some people are like, I don't want to be around him, period. Then that start coming up, and then, you know, other stuff start happening. They'll start creeping. But, I'm full. Me too. I can't eat no more. <sighs> that was a lot. Good stuff, though. That was really I had good. fun cooking this. It was really fun. I pulled it off, guys. 
It's yeah. time for it. You right yeah. after that lobster tail, it was just like Yeah, once you eat that lobster, it's like it just hits you out of nowhere. Yeah, the Man. potatoes, the shrimp was good. And oh you guys, I know you like she's eating shrimp, she's allergic. I am, you know, I it's something about when I cook it or when I make the, sh the shrimp that I don't have a bad reaction. Now, I'm just saying that now because, you know, in a minute it could happen. <laughs> but, like, when I go out and I order shrimp, I just start breaking out my throat, you know, puff up, all that. It's all that. She's weird. You knowing that that's not what's, what can happen, and then she still turn around and try to eat it. I don't, I don't get it. <laughs> I never seen anybody like that. I don't know. Oh. Uh, so guys, the beloved sauce. You clearly see we are not even done with yeah, this. Y'all gotta try that sauce. It's like, good. Like man, like for real. And like I said, she tell you like what you can like substitute or you don't have to put as much. And like I said, I didn't put a lot of spice into it, but I did put a little kick. So it got a little kick to it, but it, oh my god, it's very flavorful. Oh my god. I'm full. I, I can't eat no more, guys. I'm done. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this first mukbang. And, like I said, every Monday we're going to try to do another mukbang. If you want us to do a seafood. And next time I'm thinking about doing the crab legs. Um, oh, adding that, that into so the seafood. Yeah. Bro, I thought that was good. Yeah, that sounds good. Some so crab next, legs, oh yeah. Yeah? Oh yeah. So, next time I'm, uh, um, I'm going to try to do the crab legs with this. But, tell us what you want for the next mukbang Monday. Mukbang Monday. What you guys want us to do? And if you guys got a special sauce or a special recipe that you guys use that you guys want us to try, send that in the comments, and I will read through them, and then I'll try to do them. I'm excited. I'm excited for Mondays now. Mm -hmm. We get to eat and conversate or converse, right? The proper term, converse. Um, so, send us topics that you guys want to discuss on Mondays. Remember, our Relationship Tuesdays is always fun, so make sure you have your notification bells on. Thank you guys for liking, sharing, and commenting on our videos and sending more new subscribers. We absolutely love you guys. Yeah, for Relationship Tuesdays, you know, if you got any questions, just ask us. Yes. Just let us know. Send it, send it, send it right now. Put it in the comments. Do whatever you need to do. Mm -hmm. And we'll get to it. I'll read through it. I'm excited. I'll probably do a, a live earlier in that day just to remind you guys about Relationship Tuesday like I did last time. And it seemed like that worked better because mm -hmm. everybody was able to comment down their topics. And then later on that night, we were able to discuss. So I'm excited. So twice in one night. Yes, so twice. Twice in one night. I'm excited, guys. So we are out, you guys. We're full. I was super excited about the beloved sauce. I just said that a million times, right? I'm super excited about this that sauce. That was some good stuff. It really was. It That's really good. was. But we love y'all. Yes. We thank y'all for riding with TV Squared. Mm -hmm. And we'll see y'all next time. Peace. Peace.